In today's video, I'll be discussing two topics. Number one topic is how to know if your turkey egg is fertile or how to make your turkey eggs to be fertile. And the second topic I'm talking about is how to hash foreign turkey eggs. So look at the eggs, guys. So our foreign turkey just laid this egg right now. I'll be telling you how to hash foreign turkey eggs. But before I tell you how to hash a foreign turkey egg, what you should know is that foreign turkeys hardly have fertile eggs. They hardly have fertile eggs. Why? Because they hardly crossbreed. Due to the weight of the male turkey and due to the weight of the female turkey, it's always difficult for them to work to crossbreed. And that is why when a turkey gets to six months, seven months, for the foreign turkeys, they can start laying eggs. Massive egg like this. But when they lay the eggs, the eggs might not be fertile. And if you take the egg to hash it, you will have zero results. In fact, you waste your resources, you waste your time. But first of all, before you can get a fertile foreign turkey eggs, you have to know how to what cause breed them. And in my previous video, which I'll be dropping the link right now, make sure you watch that video. You will see it on the on the link on the description right now. Make sure you watch that video to learn how to cause breed a turkey. Because if your turkey is not cause breeded, if the male and the female do not fertilize, don't cross. Your eggs will never be fertile, never. There's no miracle. There's no prophetic manipulation that can work. If an egg is not fertile, it's not fertile. And it's not what? It's not harsh. So the first step is to what? Cross your turkey to make sure the eggs will be fertile. And how can you cross your turkey? I've already done that in my previous video, but I will be doing an overrun of it right now. How can you do that? There are two methods. The natural method and what the artificial insemination method and i've covered that on my previous video where i carried the female turkey and i kept it and i guide the male turkey to mount on the female turkey and was able to what to cross her and since he was able to cross her there is nearly there is 99 percent chances that this egg you are seeing here is what fertile. So, another thing you should know is that foreign turkeys cannot incubate their eggs. They cannot incubate their eggs. They are not like the local turkeys. If it's the local turkey, I will just allow the egg with uh, with her. She will lay a cluster of egg, sometimes ten, sometimes twelve, sometimes fourteen, sometimes sixteen, depends. She, she will lay it and she will incubate it, cover it and hash it. But foreign turkeys, they cannot hash their eggs. So how can you hash these foreign turkey eggs? How can you get a baby, a pot, out of these foreign turkey eggs? Now there are practically two methods in how to hash foreign turkey eggs. There are two methods on how to hash your foreign turkey eggs. Now the first method is the natural method. And how do I mean by the natural method? The natural method is where you take the eggs and you put under a local turkey. Under a local turkey that is about to incubate an egg. You can put your foreign turkey eggs under the local turkey and she will cover it. She needs 28 days, it will hash. Also, if you have local chickens, local village chickens, native chickens, you can actually allow the native chicken to lay their eggs. Once they are about to incubate their eggs, you remove all the local chicken eggs and then you insert your foreign turkey eggs under the chicken. She will cover the eggs and on the 28th day, the turkey egg will hash. And also, if you don't have a local turkey around you, 
you don't have a native chicken around you if you have dog fowls has laid her eggs and it's about to what incubate her eggs you can just quietly carry your foreign turkey eggs and put under her in the next 28 days you will have your what baby put foreign turkey that has hashed well, actually once they hash, if you cause them this way, once they hash, you can actually call them foreign turkeys again. You have to call them hybrids. I would have covered that topic right now, but let me not make this video too lengthy. But what you have to know is that these foreign turkeys you are seeing here, they are not the parent stock. The parent stock, the couplings that have the parent stock of a male and a female, they get these eggs, hash them, and sell to us as they old. And we raise them to this size you are seeing here. So if we cross with these ones and they hash, you may likely not call them foreign turkeys. Don't sell them as a foreign turkey to someone as same as the, uh, the, the one they import. Rather, you have to call it hybrid turkey. I think let me not cover this topic for now. I'll cover it for another time. That is why you have to subscribe to this my channel so you don't miss any of this information. Now the second way you can incubate and hash a turkey egg is by using an incubator. It's by using an incubator. And actually we have about two types of incubator. We have the foreign incubator and we have the local incubators. And of course, currently in Nigeria, we produce the local incubators. And when I mean local incubators, it's not just very local. It's the same process as a foreign incubator, but you know just that it was made right here in Nigeria. And we also produce standard automatic incubators of different capacities. So if you need that too, you can reach out to me. Any capacity, 5,000 capacity, 2,000 capacity, 500 capacity, 100 capacity, 190 capacity to supply you. So you can use your incubator to hash their eggs. So what you have to do is just you pick the eggs as they as they lay. You pick the eggs and uh, put in an incubator. But please, when picking the eggs, I will advise the eggs between when they lay the eggs to when you incubate the eggs. It should be about maybe seven days highest if you are storing these eggs it should be stored up to seven days and how do you store the eggs you store them by putting them in an egg crate but this sharp point here you are seeing here should be what kept this way inside the crate and also once in a while you adjust the crate you can put something this way to raise it this way the next day after some hours you can turn it this way that's the word to keep this egg moving so the eggs can be okay until when what you want to hash them so you can use these two methods and you put the eggs and in the last 28 days they will hash out to what a turkey pot that you can raise and start a new farm afresh so this is just the method of what hashing getting out fertile eggs and also how to hash foreign eggs so guys if you enjoyed this video look at the top of your screen you will see my other video and please make sure you watch that video and i would like you to like comment and subscribe so you can get more information from me so have a nice day